Okay, hello Ryan. Hi Mace. Hi. Okay, these two are my basketball subjects. So today we are going to do a free throw layup drill. Now one thing that I try to emphasize with all of my teams is that you win ball games making free throws and making layups. So if you have a hoop, the normal um, length away from the backboard. So the backboard is here. If you put your head and you measure all the way to the free throw line, it's 15 feet, okay? So if you wanted to, you can grab a piece of chalk. We're gonna go ahead and estimate. Go ahead and grab that chalk mace. Draw Ryan a line. If you wanted to step 15 feet, you could measure it. You could take out a tape measure. Um, younger kids, you might wanna use a line and scoot up a little bit. But what Ryan's gonna do is he is gonna shoot a free throw. Now, we're, we're really working on his form and he's gonna make sure that he has a shooting pocket. So go ahead and in here, you'll notice that this is a shooting pocket. If he flattens his hand, flatten it, now he's shooting off the palm of his hands and he wants to get it up off the pads of his hands. So as you can see, that's gonna give him the rotation. The next thing is, is I'm gonna look at his finger placement. His pointer finger should be in the middle of the ball. So I like to sometimes align it. Where's the ball pump? Find the ball pump for him, right? Right where you pump up the ball is right there and he puts his pointer finger right there. So he's gonna line himself up now Mason's gonna rebound for him so he doesn't have to get it. If Ryan misses though, Ryan's gonna grab it and he has to make two free two layups in a row, okay? And Rye, it has to be off of both sides, your right hand layup and your left hand layup, okay? Um, make sure that you step and you step, okay? All right, Rye, here we go. Let's see if he can make a free throw. If he makes it, Mason, give it back to him. Oh, all right. He's hustling, so he made it. He's gonna continue to shoot free throws. Go ahead, until he misses. As soon as he misses, he'll get his rebound and he'll have to make two layups. Okay, he hasn't missed so far, so we're watching. Oh, still hasn't missed. Okay, he's gonna grab it and now he has to make two layups. So he took off. Yep. Okay. If you noticed, Ryan went off of his inside foot on both sides. Okay. I'm going to have him do it again. And he made two in a row. Okay. Now go up. Now, Ryan missed your first layup. If he misses that, oh, he made it. Okay. If he misses it, he has to shoot it again until he makes it. Then he goes to his left side and he has to make it. Okay. Obviously the rim is down very low, so he's just barely shooting that shot. Mason, why don't you try? Okay, Mason's gonna come shoot it. Go ahead, Mace, if you need to scoot up, you can. All right, Mason's gonna see if he can get it up there. Go ahead. Okay, go get it, Mace. Two layups. Oh. Two layups. Oh, okay, go on the other side. Good. Now, I know when you're little, you're gonna wanna go off of two feet, kinda like Mason did on both sides, but what I encourage you to do is, is make sure that you step. Give the ball to Ryan real quick. Put your head under the rim, Ryan. Okay, he's gonna cross step. So go ahead, cross step and put it up. Jump off that foot though, Ryan, I know. See, one, do the other side and two. Notice how he's jumping off of his inside foot. All right, so good luck with that. Set the timer, shoot free throws and layups for at least 10 minutes today.